save money. EB21 is your code upon checkout. So there's ownership of the, of the team by fans, players, coaches. It's a we thing. It's definitely a we thing. And I understand that, that, that dynamic. It's a tremendous dynamic. It, uh, that's what makes uh, the, the games exciting so much more so because there's so much invested. Um, being a fan and being a part is saying we. Ownership is saying it's me. It is me. So when the players are playing, they're playing for the fans. They're playing for the city. They're playing for the loyalty of the base of fans that are continually cheering, paying money, buying beer, uh, paying for parking, and coming to the games. Ownership. So yes, Bob, yes, it is quite personal. But also, it's quite personal for the players, for the people that are, for the players that are giving blood, sweat, tears, emotions, going through um, different agonizing practices and preparations. Yes, that is their job. That's what they, that's what we sign up for. That's what we put our hearts, minds, and souls into. And sometimes we are the scapegoat. We are the one that did it. That, but like Buckner said, point the finger. Let's say that it was his fault. It wasn't my fault. Let's say it was his fault. Yes, and it is on a multitude of layers. There's, a, there's many, many ways that games are won and lost. But a lot of times, there's many ways to point the finger at one individual or try to point the finger at one individual. Yes, he did it. Not me. He did it. Yes, we have to be able to have ownership of both the positive and also the plays that don't come out as we wish. There are blessings within both sides. There's growth within both sides. Sometimes we, we have to fail to succeed. Sometimes we succeed to fail but they're all to me as as I aged and learned that each experience is there for us to learn and grow from so when I am the scapegoat which I which I ended up being I was the goat I was the one uh, in Cleveland Buckner was the one Bostic was the one Wilson was the one Carol was the one. So, and it goes on and on and on. And it will continue. But it will be, it should be, all shared. All the issues, all the wins and losses, all of those should be shared. But all of those experiences are there for the players, the coaches, the fans, all to maybe have some level of learning. Who knows? But it is a, it's definitely personal. And it's definitely interconnected. It's so many, so many different layers that this game is connected in. It's so much more spiritual. Uh, and it depends, a lot depends on um, much of what goes on in an interconnected way where it affects other people in a way where there is ownership, but be willing. We have to be willing to accept that. We have to be willing to take the blame, take the also be be the hero. Many games, I was the hero. Many games, but on some other layers, there's many games where I wished I'd played a whole lot better. Part of the development wins losses game with games within the games 
It's a process. I love it. And I love it to the day. There have been other critical errors in the series, but so far it is Buckner's error engraved on America's mind. Who, who, who picked it out? You know, who decided this was, this was it? You know? Whoever decided on it, it remains an iconic image of futility. And to millions, it will always be the way that Bill Buckner will be remembered. There's a lot of guys that yeah, have... Five. Pass is intercepted at the goal line by Malcolm Butler. Unreal. Malcolm Butler, who almost made the phenomenal play that wound up in Percy's arms. There are flags on the field for celebration. Amazing. Butler, a rookie free agent. Broncos trying desperately to rally. John Elway needed 10 yards for a first down. He had it, and he fumbled the ball to the Eagles, just trying to extend his hands. 28-24, Eagles with the win in Denver. Hey, Tim. So not including all the other mistakes or spreading the blame is it, it's hard to tell the entire story. I mean, I understand that. I mean, you can't just you can't point to every mistake that was made in the in the football game and explain every mistake. So the blame game, the picking out of one play that supposedly is the critical play in the game. And we always say in football, I mean within within football that each play is the critical play. You don't we don't know when that particular play may be a difference in the game. The game within the game, the the plan of the game, the mistakes that are made within the game that we don't see are known. They are known by the individuals that, that make them. So there's plenty of blame when games are being broke down uh, in, the, in the classroom, when they are being reviewed by the coaches. You know, sometimes, even within the coaching ranks, uh, there is said that that play cost us a game. But I, you have to know, I, I've always felt that even when that is being said in the coaching room, that the coaches' mistakes are being excluded. Because coaches are not perfect either. Everybody fumbles. Everybody within the organization, everybody that has something to do with what goes on on the field will make a mistake during the game, during practice, during preparation for the practices and games. There will be mistakes made. We play to be perfect. Per perfect. Perfection is an illusion. We play to be perfect. That's one of the things that we, I think, definitely I ascribe to to being and and being a part of came close once just once and that was the Indianapolis uh, playoff game in 1987 so we come back to the blame of Bartman Bostic and Buckner we come back to that to that blame and really in my estimation understand that yeah we take responsibility I took responsibility for for my play matter of fact I said it was my fault that we lost the game we're understanding there's so many other dimensions to games so many other different layers um, I think when you look at it from a holistic perspective there's understanding that is that is there but everybody does fumble Elway 
Cunningham, anybody that handles the ball. I mean, mistakes are going to be made. Look at um, Wilson. Look at Pete Carroll from uh, from this year's Super Bowl. Look at Bostic from this year. It's a process, but it, those again, those particular plays weren't the sole reason for losing. And I think you know we have to deal with our demons and deal with our our failures uh, and deal with other people um, blaming and the, the need for that to to happen. I mean, it's a phenomenon that has been going on for, for ages and will continue. You know, that's some of the jobs that, that people have. I mean, that's what they have to do is try, try to try to break games down as much as possible and pick certain plays. Uh, there's an importance in, in what is, is being done. Um, but there also is the other side of the realities, of the reality. Family, other than God, is the most important thing. So the ways that Buckner's family may have been affected is what really, really got to him. And the play, the the learning from the play, the the growth from the plays, uh, didn't didn't bother him as much as his family being accosted in any way, shape, or form. To me, it's the same thing. Listening to some of the things that my wife has told me over over time, how she would have to she would listen to some of the things that were said when people were in the autograph line, and then it was something else being said uh, when the people actually got to me. It was a little it, to me it was a little bit of, a, of an uh, awakening. Because I, I mean, I, I guess I'm naive. I'm not. If it's not in earshot, then it's not being talked about. A lot of people, some some of the fans, um, would 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 actually work up the nerve, or even be able was able to ask me about the play, and it didn't bother me. But you know that that treated me more like family than someone yelling at me in in public. Oh, the fumble. Oh, you fumbled the ball. Uh, yes, I did, but and it was it, it was a public occurrence. Uh, I know it, understand it, and have dealt with it, and still and 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 deal with it because I still get asked about it. So when people are asking me about it, I'm fine with that. No issues. Is when people take the. Uh, take the, the, the negative route, in my estimation, and just yell out stuff at me in a public forum. Um, it's, uh, it, it bothers, it, it's, it's a little bothersome. Um, but, I mean, we, we move on, I hear it, we move on, go to the next level. But you, we don't constantly remind our family members about the mistakes that they've made. Or the one mistake that they made that we that seems like we, I mean, either is 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 larger than than any other. A lot of mistakes in my career, a lot of learning that happened, and one of the biggest one of the ones uh, was the, was the fumble was dealing with that and having to um, grow through that process, having to you know go through uh, being reminded constantly of it. Um, and sometimes, you know, we do treat family members um, uh, roughly, uh, or maybe even just don't even consider, you know, what uh, what they're going through. Family, Browns fans have treated me like family overall. Hey, I mean, they welcomed me back after I went to Washington and came back to uh, to them uh, to the, to the Browns. I was able to, to go ahead and play. Um, in the last two years that uh, that the Browns were there prior to the move, uh, and the love now is still it's tremendous. Um, the events that we go out there go out to, it's tremendous, and I hope it's the same for 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 Buckner uh, as well. Bostic is is 
you know, it's on a, on a different level, but, you know, we have to, you know, we enjoy this thing. We love each other. The interconnectedness that we have is, uh, is, is a great feeling to understand that and to understand the growth that uh, happens when we go through difficult times. Um, I mean, obviously we don't want to do it, but, you know, sometimes it happens. And for the love of the game, we keep moving on. We keep grinding. We keep trying to get better. 